Hi guys, it's me Evie. What I have for you guys today is uh, chicken lo mein. I just finished making this. I was going to make the recipe and put it on my channel, but the hubby was here. My daughter just got home from school. It was really noisy, so this is what we're having, guys. Chicken lo mein. Made at home. And no, I don't have chopsticks, guys. Ooh, but it's nice and hot. I don't know if you can tell. You can see the steam. It's ridiculous hot. I just turned off my stove. Mm. So good. It's delicious, guys. Guess what I forgot? <laughs> oh, that's berry ice water. Juice. Forgot my napkin, guys. Chicken. Mm. Mm. Really soft. Mm. Juicy, very flavorful. I took two chicken breasts, big ones, diced them into cubes. Then I marinate them in soy sauce, garlic, and ginger in the fridge overnight. It gives all that flavor, look guys. Delicious. Mm. Has carrots and um carrots and cabbage. Guys, I'm so sorry because I am terribly forgetful, God. I don't know what's going on, but I'm that's scary, you know. Mm. So good. Juicy. There's a lot of little, these little mean noodles, they're huge. They're so long. Delicious. Gabby, can you bring me a napkin, Mama? Yeah. Thank you. Mhm. Mm yes, I am. Wait to me from here. It tastes so much better without those. How do you mean? This doesn't even. Are you serious? Yeah. Guys. She loves adobo. I know, but I asked you for a napkin, honey. How, um, how did you end up bringing me this? Oh, I couldn't hear you. I thought you said that. And me. even worse, I don't know why I put it on there. Sponsored by okay. It's not sponsored by <laughs> I wish. No. I don't know why I added it. I mean, but we're Puerto Rican. We basically add adobo to everything, guys. That's not true. Thank you, Mama. Mm -hmm. we, we had napkins, you know. We had napkins. <laughs> well, anyways, guys, I gotta admit, she's right. It has a different, not different, I just feel a little bit more of seasoning. Mmm, so good. Yeah. That adobo seasoning, it did add a pop of flavor. I don't know if it did, or it's just that we're Puerto Rican, so like I said, we put it on a lot of things. This is all I'm having, guys. What did I have today? Mmm. had an appointment. I took Gary to school at 7. Came back and got some paperwork that I needed. Then I went out because I had an appointment at 9. Oh, took my granddaughter to school first at 8.30 because <laughs> it was freezing. Too cold for her to walk. Mm. <laughs> really? I'm recording. 
Plus, she said sex song. <coughs> Gabby, please. I'm sorry, I'm talking on pasta. Oh my god. Choking on pasta. Here we go. Mm. Oh, this is missing, guys. Like a crunchy garlic toast. Garlic bread. That's what it's missing. Am I going to Italian and an Oriental recipe? Mmm. I don't know if you guys can see that, but the nice thick gravy just makes it so slippery, so good. Chicken. It's chicken. See, see that side right there? I seared it. I seared it all around, but you know, this one side stayed longer. I only seared it for a few minutes on each side. It came out so good. Because it's really tender. Fully cooked, but really nice and tender. Mmm. Mm. Am I really good, guys? Mm. It's freaking nice, right in the middle. There's a you know, little hole that comes out. That it comes out of. That's what I meant to say, guys. Oh, yeah. I love this. I'm actually gonna make this recipe on my other channel, but since I'm eating the uh, the chicken one now, when I make my recipe and actually upload it to my other channel, it'll be beef. So it'll be beef lo mein. You guys wanna check that out? Hmm. Hmm. Or when I actually do it, you could come back to this channel. I mean to this video and I will link it. That way you can see both the chicken and the beef. Well, you'll see me cooking the beef. Mm. Guys, it is so good. You would think, or if I serve you this, you, you would think that I bought it. And I'm feeding to you in one of my bowls because it's so good. It tastes just like restaurant quality one. The hubby and my daughter, they're eating in the kitchen because they knew they were going to eat this like pigs and they didn't want to be in it. Well, my husband's never in any of my mukbangs, but Gabby is, but she knew she wasn't going to be able to compose herself. She's pigging out over there. Man, that that was never gonna finish. Mm -hmm. so good. Guys, I feel like that meat marinating overnight is key. Because it's just so flavorful. It's unreal. So much flavor. I know that if I would have cut it up and just made it on the spot, it was not going to have that same flavor. That flavor was marinating since last night. It was perfect. Mm. And the lo mein noodles, I went to an Asian market and I bought them fresh from them. I didn't buy the ones that are dry, that are... No, these are freshly made. It makes a difference too, guys. To me, it does. I mean, because I like cooking with fresh, fresh veggies and ingredients, so it's a little bit. 
when I make the beef lo mein one, I will show you it comes in a packet. They're so good. Mm. I hear somebody in my kitchen scratching that plate. That's the way I'm doing. Mm. Deliciousness. Today's dinner, this is what it was. Mmm. Look how stuck on my tongue. So perfect. I just know when I make the beef lo mein, although it might sound Italian to you guys, I'm actually gonna make them homemade garlic bread too, guys. And it's gone. It's done. We're so good. Guys. And it's filling because, I mean, honestly, this bowl is huge. Look at my head. Look at this bowl. It's a huge bowl and it's deep, so. I'm extra full. Thank you, Jesus, for our food, for providing. Oh, yeah, guys. Hope you like this mukbang. I hope you will check out my other channel. It's cooking. It's a few different things, but... I will be making the beef lo mein one next. I'm not saying it's going to be in a couple of days. That's not going to happen. Maybe next month for March. So thank you for watching. If you're new to my channel, like and subscribe. And you're welcome to my channel. Um, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye. God bless you.